Good afternoon, everybody. How many of you remember Charles Manson? I was just a little girl when all that happened with Charles Manson. Charles Manson uh, was the mastermind behind the murders of Sharon Tate and uh, several other people. Sharon Tate uh, was an actress. She was in her 20s, I believe. Uh, she, uh, she was eight months pregnant with her baby when Charles Manson and uh, his two gurus uh, murdered the people. They stabbed Sharon Tate X amount of times. She begged for her life, and yet they, they stabbed her and killed her and her unborn baby. They, uh, they stabbed the other people. There was, there was four of them at Sharon Tate's house. They killed all of them in one night, and then the next day, uh, they went and they stabbed and killed Lino and Rosemary uh, LaBianca. Uh, they stabbed Mrs. LaBianca, I think, 40-some times. The two girls that were with Manson, I think they were like the big hippie hats and stuff, and... Uh, he, um, Mr. Frawley wants to play, but he's done. Good boy. Anyway, um, he, what, well, he was convicted of the murder through joint responsibility rule, which makes each member of a conspiracy guilty of the crimes his fellow conspirators commit. So, even though the girls are the ones who actually did the killing, He's just as guilty. He was placed on death row uh, at one time, but it's since been taken off of death row and just given life in prison. The two girls uh, who were with him that uh, helped commit these murders were also sent to life in prison and are still in prison to this day. But here's the interesting thing. Charles Manson is coming up on, per I mean, coming up for parole. He's been denied parole every time. The last time he had a parole hearing was 15 years ago. Uh, they say at his uh, parole hearings, you know, he just he doesn't show up. He now has a court-appointed attorney. Uh, his court-appointed attorney is 48 years old. So, um, not even sure if that attorney was even alive or, or was just a baby, if so, when, when all this happened. But anyway, his court-appointed attorney is now saying that Charles Manson does not need to be in prison. said prison is not doing Charles Manson any good. Charles Manson needs to be in a mental institution. And we all know what that means. His lawyer is basically trying to get him put in a mental institution so that way he could uh, maybe get out at some time before his life is over. Charles Manson, by the way, is 30, uh, 79 years old. Uh, this is not going to work. This is not going to happen because the prison system is saying Charles Manson has not been an ideal prisoner from day one and has even uh, since uh, been caught with illegal contraband as, you know, uh, in 2012. So Charles Manson is not trying to behave in prison. He's not trying to behave now. He doesn't care. Uh, they said he even took a pen and sharpened the edge of it, trying to make a weapon just two years ago. I believe the lawyer, the court-appointed attorney that is trying to get Charles Manson taken from prison and into the mental institution just wants this to get his name out there and for the notoriety of it all. Uh, Charles Manson, I don't believe, will ever be released. He uh, is famous for the... Uh, they, they, when they killed Sharon Tate the baby, and the four other people, they wrote in the blood, Helter Skelter. They got that from a Beatles song. Uh, one of the people that he killed along with Sharon Tate was, uh, I don't remember what her first name was, but her last name was Folger. She was the heir to the Folger's Coffee Company. Uh, so, he, uh, Charles Manson, they're talking about how he doesn't, looking in his eyes, it doesn't look like he has a spirit anymore. Well, he shouldn't have. 
you know, he doesn't need to be out on parole. Oh, his lawyer admitted that he never met Charles Manson. He was supposed to meet with Charles Manson and talk about uh, the par upcoming parole hearing. But he went to the prison, and Charles Manson just would not meet with him. So this uh, attorney is going to go through with a parole hearing on his own and talk in Manson's behalf, which I would say we all know that parole is not going to happen, but in this day and time and all the shit that's going on in the world, I don't know. You know, they might surprise us and say, yes, Charles Manson has served his time. Some people, his lawyer's even trying to say that, that <clears throat> look at all the years he's been in prison, that, you know, now he's in the last years of his life, that he needs, you know, to experience some life. Just think about this. Sharon Tate's baby never got to experience life. Sharon Tate was only in her 20s, so... <clears throat> She's not going to lay dead in her grave and then get up in her 70s and experience life. Uh, all the other people that he helped murder are not going to be able to experience the rest of their life. So, Charles Manson does not need to experience any more life. Charles Manson needs to rot in jail and then burn in hell. And until next time, Bye-bye.